So, uh, a lot of questions out there have been asked of us, and uh, one of them is, uh, what is the difference between cruise control, auto steer, and autopilot? Well, autopilot is actually a combination of the auto steer capability where the car can steer itself and the adaptive cruise control. So those two things together make autopilot. Now, what is adaptive cruise control? Well, that's basically just cruise control, but it has the ability to um, set the speed based on the car ahead of you. Let me show you what that means. So I'm basically in a construction zone right now. Um, I'm going, I'm, I don't have cruise control on at all right now, um, but I'm gonna put cruise control on. Not, I'm not putting autopilot on or auto steer, I'm just putting cruise control on. So all you do is you just take that, there's a cruise control stock. Um, it's basically right down here where my fingers are. I'm gonna pull back once, and that, init that initializes, so it turns on um, cruise control, adaptive cruise control. So I got it set for 55 miles an hour, and you can see the little blue area there. That means that adaptive cruise control is turned on. Um, now I'm steering myself manually, just using adaptive cruise control. And you can see there's a car ahead of me, he's going like 49 miles an hour. Cruise control is set for 55. So what that means is I'm based, the car is doing cruise control, it's driving, it's it's actually uh, you know, hitting the accelerator for me and setting the speed. And it all sets the speed based on the car ahead of you. Unless the car ahead of you is going faster, then it'll only go 55 miles an hour. Another cool thing you can do too with adaptive cruise control is you can actually take this little knob here and you can turn it back and forth. And what that does is that sets your length, car length. So I'm gonna crank up the speed because people are going faster now. So we'll crank it back to 55. And we're gonna we're gonna go um, right into this uh, semi here. So the semi is definitely not going 75 miles an hour with the cars on there. And our car is gonna know what the speed is and it's gonna set its speed based on that semi. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. Again, this is just adaptive cruise control. I'm not doing autopilot at this point. I'm not using the steer, auto steer. See so how it's slowing down? It's matching that guy's speed. And then based on that little turn that I did before, I can actually tell how close I want it to get. I just had about three car lengths. And that's basically like adaptive cruise control. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna get over here in the other lane and I'll show you once we get over out from behind this guy It's gonna automatically take off and give me a 75 And again if that guy ahead of me is going slower than 75 it'll set the speed based on that So the auto steer um, can't be used cannot be used without um, cruise control You know what I'm saying? So so the autopilot is auto steer and cruise control together. So all I have to do is pull back twice on this stock right here. And now we're on autopilot. So that's basically using auto steer and adaptive cruise control. So hopefully you guys, hopefully that makes sense to you guys, the difference between auto steer, adaptive cruise control, and then autopilot is the combination of the two. All right, see you later. Oh. If you like Tesla Tim, subscribe to our channel.